Welcome to the Wonderful Wednesday Shave of the Day, Episode 1. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving. And tonight, we are going to be using my Wade and Butcher for Gentleman Juice. 15 16 blade, Barber's Notch. It is a wedge, guys. Very nice. Out of the uh, mid-1800s. So, it is a wonderful shaver. And for our soap, we're using Stubble Trouble, and this is yard work. All right, this, I'm telling you, is just filling up the shaving den. It's incredible. Really is uh, the aroma of fresh cut grass, guys. I really enjoy that. So now, we are going to pour off that bloom water and put that on real quick as a pre-shave, like normal. Mmm. Oh yeah, nice. Really nice scent. If you like fresh cut grass in the outdoors, oh, marvelous. Really is. There we go. Nice. And for our brush tonight, get some of that water out of there. We're using my Omega 10,098. Excellent brush. So guys, here we go. Let's load this up. All right. So tell me, how you doing? What's going on? All right. Now, what do you think of uh, last Wednesday's shave? Yeah, we did the the budget shave of the day. Yep. And it's good. It's good. You know, honestly, I know this is a hobby and we sometimes get out of control as far as how, what we buy, how much we buy, things like that. But it's good to get back to uh, the roots and where things began, where things started. All right. And for me, that was also uh, part of the stubble trouble as well. Because Adam there in Texas that does his stubble trouble does a fine job, guys. And it is... A wonderful soap. Now, this soap, I will have all of the ingredients in the description there for you, along with the scent profile. All right. Now, on top of that, I will have uh, links for all the products I used in the shave as well, including that 30 degree strop back there with this. Oh, yeah. Check that out. Ooh, nice. Really good soap. This is 100% vegan soap as well, if that matters to you. Whoa. <laughs> Almost dropped my brush and everything. Yeah, my hands are super wet. All right. Nice. Look at that. Just incredible. This stuff just goes like gangbusters, guys. It really does. So, how you doing? I hope you're having a good week. We made it to the midweek shave. I hope you're well and you're having some good shaves. Hey, thank you guys uh, who are new that subscribe to my channel. Really appreciate you a lot. And uh, for all my subscribers been with me for a long time, 
Really appreciate you guys too. Thanks for all the comments as well. Really enjoy answering them. All right, so now this is episode one, which is with the grain. All right. Okay, nice. Really good. And this soap has got excellent cushion, very slick. And look at that, just peeling right through. That's two days growth, guys, right there. And this is, like I say, primarily with the grain. So as you see my razor going, that is more or less with the grain on my beard. Look at this stuff. Look at this wonderful, wonderful soap. What a great cushion. And like I say, super slick. You know, if you uh, just wet it again like that, oh, I'm telling you, you could buff, you could do anything you wanted to do with it. This is so good. Leaves the skin feeling so, so soft and so wonderful and slick. Oh yeah, nice. Yeah, so now, uh, with you guys, uh, do you like the tallow soaps better or do you like vegan soaps? Does it even matter? You know, I have, I have really good tallow soaps as well. that are notoriously uh, slick.
But like this uh, Stubble Trouble, can't beat it for the slickness and the cushion. It's there. Yeah, here we go. Look at that. Yeah, and for you new guys, again, that stretching, so important. I don't know which way your beard grows, but uh, stretching, stretch, stretch, stretch. And if that's contort your face, if that's uh, use your hand, your opposite hand, you know, that you're not shaving with, do it. And somebody commented uh, last week if you could shave uh, with just one hand. And I have to admit, I have seen it done before, but I find it easier to reach all the parts of your face if you use both hands. And as you do this and kind of get used to it, that uh, gets easier and easier so it's really not a big deal just take your time take it easy and it's no problem all right so that that's pass one complete looking forward to seeing you on episode two coming up next which is going to be a pass and a half all right thank you so much for watching all the way to the end really appreciate you and all you do for me click right over here to uh, see episode two click down here for a video especially picked out for you, click over here on me, subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day, and I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.